library and we're going to make a sweet handbag out of an old recycled book. Okay, for this one you're going to need a book with an attractive cover, some coordinating fabric, a utility knife, sewing machine or needle and thread, pre-made handles, some craft glue, and colored markers that match your book. To begin, use the utility knife to cut out the pages from the book. Then use the markers to fill in any spots where the color may have worn off. Stand the book vertically on a piece of paper and trace its outline. Then cut out this triangle, adding a half inch to each side. Fold the triangle in half and cut down the middle to make two equal pieces. Cut out this shape on your fabric using the paper as a pattern, adding a half inch to the height side of the triangle. Then repeat the process so that you have four triangles, two from each half of the pattern. Pin each half of the triangle right sides together and sew along the height. Then repeat. Then lay this larger triangle out on the fabric and cut a piece to match. Pin the fabric right sides together and sew along all three sides, leaving a tiny open space at the bottom to invert. Next, sew four fabric strips that'll fit into the slots on your pre-made purse handles. When you're done sewing, you should have these pieces, two triangular side panels, and four fabric tabs, three inches in length. Lastly, open your book up on your fabric and cut out its shape, adding about an inch to each side. Okay, now use the fabric glue to attach the handles to the book using the fabric tabs. Then glue one side of each triangular panel onto each end of the book. After ironing the edges of the inside lining, dot one half of the book with glue and glue the lining into place. After that half of the book dries a little, repeat the process for the other half of the book, gluing the side panels in first and then the fabric lining. This process is kind of weird and awkward, so get a friend to help you and be sure to wipe up any runaway glue before it dries. So when the glue dries, this is what you end up with. You could finish with like a big cool button on the front or use one of these snap fastener kits. I definitely recommend that you cover the entire outside with a final clear coat like a polyurethane or even a watered down white glue to prevent any extra wear and tear to the surface. Now clearly I'm a dude and I don't have an immediate use for a tiny little handbag no matter how sweet it is. But this makes a great project you can do with kids or you can give it to one of the wonderful women in your life. Take care.